A paleontologist is a scientist who studies fossils. Paleontologists travel the world digging up fossils. It's long, painstaking work. Paleontologists and their helpers chip carefully away at rock and then brush the dust away, being careful not to crack and ruin the fossil. Once they find a fossil, they cover it with plaster to protect it. They pack the larger fossils in crates and send them back to a laboratory. There, the plaster is removed and the fossil is examined. Some fossils are put in displays in museums all over the world. Understanding Fossils Today, thousands of dinosaur fossils have been found in almost every part of the world. Even though the last dinosaurs roamed the Earth 65 million years ago, fossils provide us with lots of information about dinosaurs. Every fossil has a story to tell. For example, a dinosaur footprint can tell how big the dinosaur was and a series of tracks can tell how fast or slow the animal was moving. How can a scientist find that out? By measuring the stride and pace. Stride is the distance from one footprint to the other footprint made by the same foot. Pace is the distance from one footprint to the next footprint made by the opposite foot. By measuring stride and pace, scientists can determine how fast the animal was walking or running. Here's a fossil of dinosaur teeth. Notice they are pointy and sharp. Fossil teeth can tell scientists what a dinosaur ate. How? Well, one way is for scientists to look to animals of today for clues. For example, if you look at the teeth of a real live alligator, you notice that its teeth are pointy and very sharp too. What does an alligator eat? Other animals. So that's a clue to scientists that dinosaurs with pointy sharp teeth probably ate other animals too. Animals who eat meat are called carnivores.